This is not an attempt to ban TikTok. It's an attempt to make TikTok better. Tick, tack, toe. A winner. Lady, shut your old ass up. What are you talking about? Ah, what another day when the U.S. government has disappointed their people. You boys already know what we're talking about, man, today, bro. The TikTok ban, all right? If you guys don't know, ladies and gentlemen, the U.S. government wants to ban the application called TikTok, okay? And it has now went through the House of Representatives in which they have come to a vote to outright ban the app TikTok because it so-called steals our data and gives it to the Chinese government. Not like Facebook or Twitter or Instagram does that. Hey, the Chinese government does it. It's a problem, okay? This video is going to be more of a rant, but my whole thing about this is this why. Why? The amount of problems that we have in the United States alone today is insane. Minimum wage has been the same since I was fucking born. People can barely afford to buy groceries, pay rent, buy a car. Have you seen a car price? Jesus Christ! And you motherfuckers are telling me that you guys all came together and said that, hey, hey. what we should do right now at this moment because it is a national security threat is ban a app what the fuck unless they sell the app to a u.s government in which we can make money off of it oh so that's how you gonna play it i swear to god everybody on that fucking stand that voted for this can barely even set up a roku stick and we supposed to listen to them and they supposed to tell us what's best for us as a u.s people Get the fuck out of here man it just doesn't make sense, and the entirety of TikTok content creators are upset about this because some people have made this their livelihoods. They are paying their bills off of this app, and you are willing to take that away from them. And listen, I'm a person that also has to thank TikTok at the end of the day because late 2021, late 2022, TikTok really helped my channel out. The, the algorithm really helped me out back in the day. The algorithm's kind of shit now, but it helped me back in the day, and I will give props to that. I do feel really bad for the people that built a living on off of this built a community off this and they have no say in any of this because the u.s government says that the chinese government is stealing your data Let's shut the fuck up and, and listen that whole fucking gimmick is dumb as hell man the chinese government is stealing our data but the u.s government steals our data all day every day we have been accustomed as united states citizens to get our data stealed god forbid i say halo 4 on my phone next thing i know i open up my amazon and now i've got recommendations recommendations and sponsored advertisements for halo 4 fuck no baby because what the u.s government has done here is basically said wait a second we need a reason to ban tiktok in the united states or what they came up with or what they spot on really quick was that tiktok is a chinese based company in which u.s citizens use it and their data gets sold to the chinese government but that's all a bunch of bullshit at the end of the day right the reason the united states government wants to ban tiktok is because they can't profit off of it okay Got em. they don't give a flying rat's ass about our data being sold. Facebook sells our data and was investigated by the FBI for selling their data to China. But we can still use Facebook. Instagram sells our data. Twitter sells our data. Goddamn Amazon Prime sells our data, you sons of bitches. They just had to jump to a reason like, okay, uh, the, the Chinese government steals our data. No, they wanted that money. And in which, if you look really deep into this whole situation, they say, hey, we're not gonna ban TikTok unless TikTok sells it to a US company. You see what I'm saying? here that's why they all came to an agreement about this shit is because they want the fucking big bucks man and a lot of content creators have taken out the deep dive and found out who these sons of bitches are that voted for this and one of them is this guy right here jeff jackson okay if you guys don't know jeff jackson is a north carolina congressman that won his entire election of being a congressman in my state north carolina by promoting his shit on tiktok don't do this shit to me nobody knew about this guy before he started posting on TikTok. And guess what this son bitch does? He goes out on the House of Representatives and votes yes to ban TikTok when the motherfucker used his entire platform on TikTok to win his election. But what those other social media companies don't have is an adversarial government that can influence the algorithm to manipulate the content you're shown in ways that will help them politically. Fuck you! I say this right now as somebody that uses social media and has been on social media for the longest. I have seen people murdered, people killed, people exploded on all US-based companies. There is even a federal court case in which the owner of Facebook, Mark Zuckerberg, was asked why there was an option to see anyways of CP. That ain't it. There is a option on Facebook in which if you see CP, it axes you, do you still want to see it? The results may contain images of child sexual abuse. And then you gave users two choices. Get resources 
or see results anyway. Fuck wrong with them. But you talking over here about U.S. data and algorithms and TikTok doing this, but they got all this shit going on on these other U.S.-based websites? You fucking lost your mind, Jeff Jackson. Jeff Jackson, you piece of goddamn junk. Guys, it's gotten so bad that show, the TikTok CEO, had to come out with a statement about what's going on. Over the last few years, we have invested to keep your data safe and our platform free from outside manipulation. We it's not about data, show. We will continue to do so. This legislation it's not about is signed into law will lead to a ban of TikTok in mm. the United States. Yes, this he's bill right. gives more power to a handful of other social media companies. It will also take billions of dollars out of the pockets of creators yes, and absolutely. small businesses. It will put more than 300,000 American jobs at risk and it will take away your TikTok. But, and listen, I love this show guy, man. He made the app, he's a TikTok CEO. But show, at the end of the day, it's not about the data. They don't give a fuck about data. It's about the big bucks, boys. At the end of the day, it's about the money, the greed, the sin. Because if they cared about data, they say Facebook, stop stealing people's data. Nope. Amazon, stop stealing people's data. Nope. Twitter, stop stealing people's data. Nope. They don't give a flying rat's ass about our data, guys. And whenever you get into the system of a social media that has my monetization sponsorships you are automatically getting your data stolen ladies and gentlemen Damn. they don't give a flying fuck as soon as you make that account and as soon as they hear you say something about something you want to buy they're going to throw advertisements they're going to throw sponsorships at you because they're stealing your data and they're using it to profit off it okay they want that goddamn bread they want that goddamn money because they can't make a profit sharing off of tiktok and you guys want to know the reason why facebook and twitter and google aren't banned because of their data privacy policies it's because politicians have stocks in those companies okay politicians have stocks in meta politicians have stocks in alphabet which is google why the hell would we tell them to stop selling your data which is making us money in our stocks they don't give a flying rat's ass about us guys at the end of the day the u.s government has screwed us i'm not a big fan of the government 30 on 30 i'm not a big fan of the government yeah the 30 on 30 end of the day guys it's gonna get banned if the senate approves it okay it went through the house of representatives all it has to go through is go through the senate and sleepy joe already said that if the bill was to come to his table one day and say a ban for TikTok was available, he would sign off on it and TikTok would be banned, okay? And the main reason I'm really pissed off about this, guys, and what I'm really gonna miss about TikTok is that TikTok has some of the most creative content creators on that app man i have so many edit musics bookmarked in my bookmarks because of how fire they are and i am going to be so upset if i lose all of them man i'm gonna be so fucking upset i'm gonna start downloading them now <sighs> this is all i got and listen guys i've said in the past that tiktok can be cringy and sometimes it's a little cancerous but i still believe that it's a good platform at the end of the day and i still believe that people should be able to make content on there it sucks that people are gonna lose their livelihoods off of this shit because people have built a community built up a good revenue and they're gonna lose that over some bullshit because the u.s government can't make money off of it it's it, it's complete fucking bullshit guys it's bs you know i just really wanted to get my opinion out there on this because i, I use tiktok I, I like tiktok i i like tiktok content creators i know a lot of guys from tiktok that you know have made success off of this and i've got to give some of my success to tiktok as well because of the way the algorithm set me up a few years ago but yeah man i hope you guys enjoy the video drop a like on this subscribe and yeah man it's uh sucks to be an american today all right but at the end of the day boys at the end of the day we gonna use that vpn hell yeah